Hey guys, welcome back to some more AFK Arena. Today we're over on the YouTube account. Should be a pretty easy progression here, guys. Heroes of Esprit, we're already 10,000 plus. We do have to hit that 12,000 to go ahead and hit Masters. That way we can maximize the loot we have in here. Treasure Scramble, we're at 52, so still doing pretty good in there. I'm pretty happy with our position, guys. But we have some serious progression to make here in the here, um, Heroes of Esprit. Now, overall, I don't assume this is going to be super difficult, guys, because we have been kind of slacking a little bit. We came in here, we did our three daily battles, and that was it. So you can see, guys, even here we're 318, 304. So a lot of players have made an incredible amount of progression. And I just want to go through here and get these done. Um, hopefully, we can get up to the where we need to. And again, we need about 1,800 points, guys. But if we're getting 140, um, 100 plus, even on resets, even on diamonds, this is the last day, guys. This is it. This is the time to make the last push for as far as you can go because we have 21 hours left. That is it, guys. That is really all that you have um, in here. And I'm hoping, again, that we can make this pretty easy. I know I'm, I'm pretty heavily over-leveled. Even hero-wise, guys, it's made a really, really big difference, even in the treasure scramble, since I've been building out a lot more heroes. We got furniture up on... Um, we got furniture up on Lucila, which again makes a pretty big difference in a couple of these comps where we're running Liberta. So getting them, getting them built out, getting a couple of the key heroes even stronger, again, makes it seem pretty easy in here. But we know that we're over leveled, guys. Even looking at the deficiency, I mean, we're 18, what, 22? 22 player levels, which is essentially, what, times 10? That, that's 220 levels higher then who we're fighting in here. Now, 107 right here for another 100 points. We're going to have to buy some tickets. The question is how many and how many times are we going to have to spend um, to actually buy some tickets? So there is star one giving us some more baits, still building out a lot of these, um, these beasts. Guys, we've made a lot of progression. We have the seal to 18, pushing some more to 15, and then it is literally just going to be a race, guys, to get everybody to 18 in a very specific order but we are going to have to again continue to push and continue to build up those beasts because they make a massive massive difference when it comes to um nightmare corridor when it comes to the cursed realm the twi the um twisted realm everything including the treasure scramble beasts are huge guys and we're making some pretty good progression i mean when we're seeing 170 plus even here you can see the level deficiency is getting a lot closer to where we're at guys so as we continue to move in here as we continue to make progression a lot of players so i go through here again easy on the youtube account i go through here super super cautious on the free to play account so i make sure i know the battles that i'm fighting i make sure that i know the lineup that i'm fighting um just based on the heroes even here guys 155 to 118 123 is about where we're at we're about 10 levels over so i mean we are a little bit again Still over on this one. I just hopped on today and I was like, oh, it's over today for the Heroes of Espria. So I knew, guys, we needed to make some progression and we needed to make some solid progression today because this is literally it. You can see Luc Lucretia in here. What do we need? We're close. We're already close, guys. Bobby, look at look at the uh the the um Avatar frame right there. That was really, really cool looking. All right. So where are we at, guys? I think that is it. We just have to get a couple more. This is where literally you usually hit the wall, even for an account like we have right here, guys. Look at this, 318 to 315 for only a few points. This is, again, this is going to be where we run into our wall. Sort of being, I mean, 153, that's going to be pretty big. I think he might even be higher level than I am. Three levels. We should be able to get this, guys. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. We do get the victory. What do we... Oh, we need 99. We need another 30 points. You know what? I'm going to go for a weaker hero. So, Candy, unfortunately, you will be the one that we're going to utilize. Hopefully, if we can win. Boom. There we go. Will that take us? 290. Oh, we're short. We're nine short. Um, Who do we got? 100, 100. Look at how low these are, guys. All right, got to buy some more tickets in here. Jaeger, I think this will be it, guys. We got a 10-level 
deficiency in here. There we go. That is it. Boom. Congratulations. You have hit the Masters. This is what we were waiting for, guys. A lot of players haven't seen it, but it's really cool. So this is the Masters. Now, this is where all of the big dogs play. So all of um, the, the top players, we have the, the Masters. So even looking here, guys, this is what we were farming it for was the Stargazer Scrolls. Get some Tier 4 stones in there, which is really cool. But looking at the leaderboard, guys, there are some massive. So even here, I'm at 222. They're at 458, 459. As literally, they're double over double the power that we possess in here. And also looking at this game mode, guys, we're at what? What did it say? One or 222? Um, in here, you do have more teams. That is right, guys. This goes to seven teams within here. So you thought the treasure scramble was kind of crazy and the teams that um that we have in there, but this gets the exact same, guys. So we have Mishka in there. I'm seeing what we have because I believe we can do our Taylene comp in here, which we'll go ahead and swap a few in here. Um, let's go with Zorath in here. I'm gonna actually put Kanisa and Rook up front. I'll put Zorath up here. We'll run it like this. Um, in here we got the owl. You know what? I'm gonna go for some crowd control. So we're gonna be rocking that team, which actually I think it may be not Zorath. Yeah, actually, I th I think I'm gonna drop out Mortis just because, guys, I have Frampton built out so high. Um, that might work. They're running Tarnos though. Tarnos is still very, very strong, guys. But let's see who we got left. So we have Thane in here. I think I'm gonna run the old school Thane comp. I, I think I might run the, run the old school Thane comp. So the old school Thane comp. Um, we're gonna get a buffer. Who do we have in here? There we go. We have Halos in here, which I like. So essentially, Halos is going to buff up Thane right here. Um, Sonya is going to do a lot of um, a lot of protection on the back, and usually Astrilda. But I'm thinking, I'm thinking for the for the buffs that we could even run like a Tamaris in here. But of course, if we put Astrilda in this formation, guys, we get the five buff for the formation. But it's yeah, she is available. Th this again, this is an older formation, guys. That that a lot of players um. Used to use, so I'm gonna run the owl in here. And I'm gonna see what we can do. We we should be able to, because again, looking at adding team six and seven, we should be able to make a little bit of progression in here. So normally though, what we do is if we can get through a victory, boom, we switch spots. We go to 1921, um, up 80 slots. The problem is we're in legend now, and usually we can never hold this. So literally at this reset, at this um this 21 hours. Players will farm each other at that point, and literally probably even by the time that I get out of this game mode, um, players will farm to a point of the very last minutes. If you get a very lucky attack with someone who's offline or someone who um, can't come back and just take you out, um, it, it's kind of crazy in the tower, but that you can see they're even swapping up here with where they are. Usually by the time I get out of the tower, I hit the mail and it says, oh no, you've already lost where you were within the, the levels, but we got to what we were looking for in the Heroes of Esperia, guys. Again, we're ranked 1921. We're gonna have to see if we hold it at all because of course the rewards in here are a little bit higher, but we do get the medal. Now, I have never gotten the medal out of here for the top 2000. Maybe, just maybe, we, we could get it because you also do get the league points, which means that we would get the frame. So we would probably get the next frame. I'm not sure. It's weird it doesn't show the points we have in here. I wish it did, but again, 2,000, 5,000, 10,000, that's a lot. That's an incredible amount of Heroes of Aspria wins. Um, I've been doing 200 at a time. As you can see, we've ran this a significant amount of time. But guys, that will do it for today's video. And it looked like I made a lot of progression. 36 here in the Treasure Scramble. Super excited about that, guys. But let me know in the comments what you guys think. And as always, thank you guys for watching.